So as we come up here, we're gonna run into one, another one of our new enemies. This is the Ravager. And uh, this guy has a big gun and he also carries a shield. So if you're putting down a lot of fire on him, he's gonna throw his shield up and then he's gonna rush you with the shield. Uh, these guys are pretty nasty and mean and their uh, gun has a lot of battles. So as soon as they start firing, as Billy starts firing on him, you see the shield come up. So it makes it really hard to uh, do any, uh, to do a lot of damage. Now Billy's a pro and uh, has killed many Ravagers in his day. He carries the skulls around on his belt. So uh, there's no issue for Billy when killing Ravagers. Trust me, I've seen Ted die demoing that several times today. So you can hear uh, one of our radio broadcasts. Uh, Henry Stillman is in Philadelphia and you'll constantly be picking up his broadcasts across the game and hearing more about what's going on in the rest of the country and how good old Henry's doing uh, being the only person left alive in Philadelphia. So now this is kind of where we'll end this part of the demo. Uh, this is one of our big battles uh, with one of the Titans. And uh, we've given the Titans quite of a facelift from the first game, just like all the enemies. But uh, they still can pack quite the punch. So Billy's using the bullseye tag. And it's still the alt fire for the bullseye. All the weapons have different alt fires, just like the different one. Stick an air fuel grenade on him. So now Billy's going to go and grab the Lark. Everyone's favorite R1 weapon. And the Lark secondary fire now fires off a whole storm of mini rockets. And uh, a couple of those and uh, the Titan's just going to get turned into some big chunks. Again, showing the new gore that's present in the game. So that's uh, Auric. Okay, we get that one too.